<sighs> I'm, I'm gonna keep it a bug with y'all, man. I'm gonna keep it a bug with y'all. Okay? I'm, I'm gonna keep it a hundred with y'all. Alright? I'm not gonna lie, man. I'm not gonna lie. I was gonna buy this game. But this this was the nail in the coffin for me. Alright? This, this is probably the biggest L of 2022. Actually, you know what? I'm not, I'm not gonna hold you. This is probably the biggest L of the Switch life cycle. Like, this is probably worse than ARMS. Like, I'm not I'm not even going to cap. I'm not even going to cap, okay? So, before I actually start off this video, let me just say that the core gameplay of Mario Strikers Battle League is amazing. It's great. It's fun. After I played the first kick demo, I was like, yo, I think I'm, I I'm going to have to pre-order Chief, right? And um, I actually ended up canceling the pre-order all right and so ah man this this is this is this is absolutely nuts all right the gameplay of this game has tech all right you really have to learn this game okay you know the perfect passes the shooting and so on and so forth right so a few weeks back when we when we learned that this game had only 10 characters, okay, it was definitely, it's definitely lacking compared to the previous, uh, games, okay, no Daisy, you know, there's no, uh, no Diddy Kong, no Bowser Jr., right, you know, no sidekicks, people were, you know, we were, we were, we were going bananas, okay, that this game was, was basically, um, not having it, all right, you know, then when I played the first kick demo, I was like, okay, okay, I'm, I'm liking this. I'm really liking this. So, when the game reviews came out, right, which was about a few days, a few days ago, at the recording of, of this video, which is actually the release of the game, okay? So, a few days ago, when you know, a whole bunch of reviews came up, you know, you had your good old IGN and your GameSpot and your, you know, Game Explain came out, you know, and then you had uh, Digital Foundry and you had some other people, you know, reviewing the game. Right, they were saying how this game was very lackluster in single player. So, the, so, so not only the the character roster is lacking. Okay, and I'm not gonna spend too much time on this because we we already we already we already know this. Okay, this is, this is ba we're basically beating a dead horse, but we're basically gonna beat it even more. Okay, once we found that out. That there's no, you know, that there's just such a lackluster character roster. The single player is lacking, right? Single player is absolutely lacking. There's, there's only like one mode. And it's basically just you going through teams and just getting the cups for, you know, for, you know, for whatever, for whatever cup. You know, there's a muscle cup and then there's like this cup and that cup, you know, this and that. And, you know, it, you know, it's, it's whatever, right? It's just really lackluster. There's no, there's no really no story or no campaign or you know it's just like you know and apparently you can you can beat it in like an hour or or two to two right it's, it's very quick okay it's very fast it just i don't know it's, i feel like there's really no life into the single player so here i am i'm just sitting back and i'm looking at these reviews and i'm just like okay all right um the game it, it seemed like they're going for a multiplayer focused game right the game is multiplayer focused okay so, here I am looking online about this game, and uh, a friend hits hits me up, and he's like, "Bro, um, uh, yeah, bro, this 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 ain't it, Chief." And I'm sitting here like, "What what are you what are you talking about?" So I look into this, and boy, let me tell you, th this 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 is not good, bro. So let me just sidetrack real quick and say that. Not only the game is lacking in character roster, but the stadiums also are lacking. Um, it, it's very samey. It's the same old grass. It's just a, just a whole different color palette and whatnot. And another thing that I noticed was that the stadiums are actually smaller from the previous games. I don't know. I actually had to go back and look at gameplay and, and jog my memory to see. Yes, the field, the stadium in Mario Strikers Charge and in Super on the GameCube actually is much bigger, all right? And also the stage hazards as well. 
right? So in my mind, I'm thinking, okay, this this game is just completely just it, it, it's it's as it's as it's as lacking in, in almost everything except for the multiplayer. And I'm like, there's there's no way they can ruin the multiplayer, right? There's absolutely no way that they can ruin the multiplayer. And here I am contemplating this pre-order on Amazon, right? And what happened was I actually ended up canceling the the pre-order, and I'm getting my money back by the way, because this is this is honestly ridiculous, right? So, come to find out, come to find out, uh, Nintendo actually false advertises game. And you're probably wondering, what do you, what do you talk about? <laughs> what do you what, what do you talk about? What do you, what do you talk about right now? Okay, so, <laughs> oh man, this is this is bro, this is actually this is this is sad, bro. This is actually sad. Come to find out, you cannot play 4v4 online. Yes, yes, yes. E even though, even though if you go into the eShop and you go to the game, it says 1 to 8 players online. That's what it says. If you if you can go to eShop right now, you can pause this video right now and you can go into the eShop, go to Mario Strikers, right? Since it's a, you know, a new release, you know, it'll be right in your in your face. Click on it, scroll down, and it'll clearly see 1 to 8 players online. You cannot play 4v4 online okay and so you're probably you're probably wondering what do you this is this already doesn't make any sense okay so the only way for you to do a 4v4 online is if a local player is on each switch and i'm sitting here like this this is actually the most dumbest thing i've even <laughs> bro i i i Oh my goodness. So basically, you cannot have eight switches online. All right. The only way if it works, if my homeboy comes to my house and I'm talking to my homeboy on Discord and his homie comes to his house and the same thing also has to apply for the other team. That is the only way it works. So it's not like I can get three other dudes online and play against four, four other dudes online. Even though the game was pretty much advertised that way. It's like, bro, this is a colossal L. And then before somebody says, oh, well, probably the Switch Online can't handle it. That's a bunch of baloney. Because Splatoon can do it. Mario Kart can do it. For crying out loud, third party games can do it as well. If you play Doom on the, on the Switch, right? So eight players online and up is... is, is is doable like I don't see what the problem is it's like not only this game is lacking in single player it's lacking in character roster it's lacking in stadiums but it's also lacking in multiplayer it's like how does that work and not only that the game don't even got no spectator mode there's no custom games right there's no private battles it's like for a game that is focused on multiplayer, y'all dropped the ball so badly. It's like, how do you do that? Like, this is crazy to me. And here I am on the internet going all over the place, going to Discord. I went to the, the, the freaking uh, Mario Strikers Discord. I went to Twitter. I went to live streams. I went to videos. Just trying to find out if 4v4 is, is confirmed. And come to find out it's not. And I'm sitting here like, yo, this is, this is absolutely insane. And I'm sitting here like, so what is the point on having 20 people in your club if you can't even 4v4? Does that make any sense at all? Can somebody please tell me on how this makes sense, right? And come to find out, another thing that I found out was that if you hop, if you make a club, Right. And let's say you have like most people join your club and let's say their main or whatever is like, let's say they all chose like Mario. When you hop in a game by yourself, I don't even know why you would hop into a club game by yourself if, it, if it's club. Right. If you hop in by yourself or with somebody else. Right. Because it's basically 2v2 online. Right. If you do that, the only characters that you can choose from are the characters that your club mates chose. So I'm sitting here like, what? I mean, 
that that doesn't even make any sense right the biggest ball drop i've ever seen in a nintendo game like bro, if you if you if you got this game digitally, bro, and you want a refund, bro, bro, you better you better hit up that phone, bro. You better hit up that Nintendo hotline, bro. All right, and if you got it physically, obviously you can get a refund. Cause bro, I hit that I hit that refund so fast, I canceled that thing so quick. I was like, there's no way that they pulled this off, my G. It's like this game is lacking on all aspects: single player, character roster stadiums multiplayer it's like it's lacking in every single thing and i don't even know why that they rushed this game not even they rushed the game they false advertised the game y'all rushed the game and y'all false advertised the game like this game is basically doa bro is dead on arrival right so if you're gonna get this game honestly you have to wait you can't get this day one you cannot get this day one and i don't even know why nintendo even decided to even release the game with such little content it's like that's not gonna do anything that just makes for for people that actually research and actually look into the game and actually find out what's on the game day one they not gonna buy it bro only only actual casuals are gonna go out and buy the game because they see oh it's mario strikers oh i play that game on gamecube oh i played uh charge on wii oh i'm a cop it's like it, it, it's, it's a mess, man. This game is a, is a big, fat mess, bro. That's it for this video. That's it for this rant. Um, Let me know what y'all think. Uh, If you bought the game, then okay, you bought the game. If you're going to keep the game, then okay, we keep the game. But as for me, no freaking way that they false advertise this game. I'm out of here.